to that dad guy we are in the province of quebec we are on our vacation so i thought i'd take you along we are at the montmorency falls and uh it is a beautiful day look at that sky so we left moncton it was a bit rainy and overcast but now that we're in quebec it's beautiful so let's go have a look section here where you can go zip line here across by the falls. cable car system over here so Ari and I are going to check it out and uh, see what it costs to get us back to the top of the hill rather than walking all those stairs again. But a gorgeous day nonetheless. Oh and there's some seagulls just chilling out on the rock formation at the bottom. And then when you get off the tram, you're looking down here. Up to the manor house. Quebec City has a big winter festival, Bonhomme de Neige. Well, they're doing it in the summer too. So instead of having ice sculptures, they've put out all these interesting um i don't know not ice <laughs> so i can see some of the things that are here there's some activities there is a big slide for kids to go down on one side and then we have some of the uh, mannequins that are around including bonum which is the guy here with the red hat i've never been to the winter festival it was something i would love to do one day but there's Carnaval de Quebec. This gives you an indication of what it looks like. There's the ice house that was built in 2023. You can see going back to 1956. And some of the other years, some of the amazing sculptures that would have been here, all made out of ice. And then 
the events that take place that go along with it. The city comes alive in winter time. Makes sense being a winter province, winter city, and uh, in a winter country. And you see the big snowflakes on the ceiling. And voila, let's continue on. Yeah, this is the bridge that goes right over top of the falls. It's gonna get a little bit loud. We're above it. Montmorency Park worth a trip if you're in Quebec City you should come and check it out there are lots of things to do and uh, whether it's summer or winter really cool to see I know in winter time they've got lights that go under the falls so as the falls freeze you can see the lights uh, going through the ice let's go see what happens next welcome to old Quebec the closest thing you'll find to Europe within Canada Feel like someone is watching you. <laughs> and when you need a post office, they've got one of those too in old Montreal. How's that for a cool little bike? And we're coming up on Chateau Frontenac, one of the best hotels in the country. Works Canada. Samuel de la Champagne. Frontenac.
want to get your portrait done, we've got people to do that. We've got the old buildings, we've got cafes and bistros all along, markets. This fountain in front of the provincial legislature in Quebec City reminds me so much of the fountain from the TV show Married with Children. I don't know if you guys have seen it, but that's what this reminds me of. But it is a beautiful spot. And you can see there are the walls that surround old Quebec. We are here on just such a beautiful day that everything that we see is just sticks out with uh, gorgeousness the blue sky the copper roofs on the uh, old uh, buildings that are here the flowers are still in bloom the fountains are going it's just a beautiful summer day Well, you can see we are at the end of the day. It is dark outside. We found ourselves a hotel. Uh, tomorrow we leave for Montreal to begin the adventure there. So thank you, Quebec City. That was a quick snapshot of Old Quebec and uh, Montmorency Falls. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I know we had a good time. The weather was perfect. We got a good meal while we were here and uh, just had fun just wandering around. I even bought some postcards, which I'll show you later on when the trip is all done. All right. You guys have a magical week. Like, follow? You say like, subscribe, share, and tell all your friends. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy?